Welcome to Tech Results with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn about case sensitive data. Often, uh, we have uh, data in the table uh, that uh, start with the uh, uppercase, lowercase, and all that. And sometimes we really want to find out that data or get the data that is uh, specific to that case sensitivity. Sensitivity. So now, let's uh, go ahead and take a look. Uh, here, uh, I have my uh, table, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and drop this table first, uh, and then recreate. Uh, this table has some uh, columns such as customer ID, first name, last name. Uh, so we will be inserting some different type of data here and that will help us uh, to write those queries uh, and experiment on that. Uh, so see right there, there is Amir and uh, then uh, we have Amir here. This is the uppercase Amir. So we'll start with the A capital. Here everything is small, lowercase. And then we have uh, Amir here uh, and uh, there is a one at the end uh, that is the uh, IR is capital. So that's type of data we are inserting in the first name now think about that uh, if you would like to get all the records uh, from customer table where your first name contain armor so if you run a container uh, with uh, this value what's gonna happen is gonna return you all those values doesn't matter which uh, uppercase lowercase and all that uh, it is going to return everything so it's gonna uh, ignore the case sensitivity but now there are some situations where you would like to get only specific case sensitive data so let's say in this case you would like to get only armor everything in the lower case see right there there is only one record so what you can do in Kusto there is a contain underscore CS that's a function that or operator that can help you to get that data so there are other uh, functions of um, in Kusto there are tons of them uh, they ends with the underscore CS that means case sensitive once you use that it will make sure that you are getting the data according to the case sensitivity so in this case if we go ahead and execute this one it's returning us only Amir. So now let me go back again and uh, see right there and see right there uh, there is Amir. So if I will put uh, A capital or uh, uppercase now I'm going to get uh, this record. So execute this and you see that that's what we got. Now uh, there is an in clause that also helps us to find the records and uh, that uh, see what it does with the uh, in clause so if you use in clause it is a case sensitive so you see right there i put amir it did not return us three records like contains it returns what we put here so it is all lowercase so it return everything lowercase if i will go ahead and put a here then what's going to happen it's going to return me exact match of this value see right there there is a a m i r so this is a capital a so with the in clause, if you are interested to get everything and ignore the case sensitivity, you can do that by using tilde after the in clause. So in this case, we select everything from customer where F name, first name, in, and we have put tilde here. That means ignore the case sensitivity. So get me everything, but wherever it is armor, it doesn't matter if it's uppercase, lowercase, and all that. So you see right there, it got us all that. Now think about this scenario where we would like to get all the records which start with AA. Now if you do that, what's going to happen is going to get you all the records that doesn't matter. This is lowercase or uppercase. See right there, there is a uppercase A. It did not cared about it. It got us all of that. But if you want to make sure you start with the underscore CS, that means you are specifically telling it should be this one should be uppercase this should be small case so now if you execute this uh, statement you are going to get uh, the record where it exact uh, match so in this case we are saying where it starts with a capital small a so that's what it is right now now the same way if you are going to go ends with so in this case if you will say first name ends with i or and uh, see right there this ir is capital if i execute it does not care about case sensitivity and it matches with all the record wherever it find ir small or capital now but if i want to make sure it is case sensitive what i have to do i have to say ends with underscore cs case sensitive and then provide the value whatever i'm looking for here if i will provide a small ir then it's going to get me two records this ir and this ir so let's execute this and now you see that there are two records which ends with the, with the small ir at the end if i will go ahead and put a uppercase ir then it's going to return me the values which ends with the capital ir right there 
Okay, so I hope uh, you learn uh, where to use a CS, uh, wherever you need the case sensitivity, you will use uh, with that, uh, ends with, uh, which starts with, uh, or contain and all that. Uh, so there are tons of other functions where you will be using uh, this. Um, I hope this video is helpful. Thanks very much for watching. Please subscribe my channel and I will see you guys in the next video.